Hi, welcome to our video in the Microtasker Shorts series. Today we're going to be looking at the Freedom KL26 board and its low power modes. We've got three minutes, so let's get started. First thing to do is to configure for the board we want to use. In the project configuration file, I search for the Freedom K26, it's here, and select it. I disable any other board which happened to be enabled when I started. I'm going to need a serial interface, so let's go and find this and enable it. Now I've got a debug output. I don't want USB because USB is not very interesting for real low power work, so I'm disabling the USB interface. Now I've moved to my clock configuration. We're going to take it slow, so I'm going to run the chip directly from its 4 MHz RC clock. Because I want to show some very low power run mode, I'm going to set the flash and the bus clock down to 800 kilohertz. The final thing that I'd like to change in this file is the low power timer. I'm going to enable this so that we can use our system tick directly from it, which gives us more flexibility in the low power modes. So that we can actually get out some of the very low leakage modes, I'm going to enable a wake up now this wake up will be on port PTC3 which happens to be the switch on this board and now I rebuild the project now I'm performing a sanity check by running the simulator here we see the simulation operating we got our debug output, we have a 4 MHz clock, and also we have an 800 kHz flash clock. So I load to the board. Here we have the board operating, its debug output. Presently we're operating in very low power stop mode, which is giving me about 70 microampere. I'm going to change the mode. We go up a little bit to mode 3, which is the very low power run mode. We see that the current uh, increases to 300-400 uh, microampere. We're going to set it down into the low power or rather low leakage stop mode which is number five now if you look at the cam you'll see that the LED stopped blinking we've got about three microampere current consumption to get out of this mode I'm going to press a button there we are, we're woken up again and uh, what's happened is we've been put back to <coughs> weight mode which is taking about 1.3 microampere very last one I'm going to set an extremely low power mode number six let's try very low leakage stop goes down to about one microampere now this mode I cannot get out without having a software reset and the wake up button will also give me a software reset got it time's up again I hope you enjoyed the video any questions just ask them if you want to develop better and faster get Microtasker easy as that